Hi everyone, uh, welcome to the next installment of uh, Martian Worlds uh, Progress Update. Uh, we got some cool things going on here now. We got some uh, water effects, we got some gradient sky effects, we have the sun. Um, what else do we have? We also have uh, underwater effects as well. We got some bubbles that go up as well. This is actually um, not. Um, those are actual real bubbles being spawned and floating to the top and the up vector of their floating uh, direction is based on direct distance from the center of the planet of course so it takes uh, I guess I don't I think they're rigid bodies as well but anyway so you got fog effects um, you got some gradient effects too from beach uh, pebbles uh, as you can see here just some pebbles going all the way up to beach sand oh. Well, I'm actually in the north. In the north area, it's like snow. So this is like the North Pole. So you actually start around the North Pole. So if you're wondering why the grass looks kind of like white <laughs> washed, it's because the snowy peak uh, at the North Pole. Move away from the North Pole um, somewhere else. I just jumped. See, you can see kind of it's yeah, just the North Pole. Anyway, um, if you move away from that, you'll get more of the actual nice of the ground and the textures start popping through that's because there are some issues typically with how textures work on the, uh, the north and south poles uh, which is typical of uh, you know any kind of sphere rendering but I managed to mitigate it somewhat so you can actually see it's not terrible you can see a little bit of fanning going on there but I found an algorithm to help reduce it somewhat um, anyway moving on so we have some um, Again, cool uh, lens effects. You may have noticed that if you look at the screen. So if I pull out of the water, ooh, <laughs> isn't that cool? Check that out. Let me back out again. Oh yeah. So there's some um, wet lens effect, and when you go into the water again, you can see the bubbles going up. They're being spawned. So and of course the wavy effects and everything else. Um, fog effects it's all pretty cool yeah F fairly realistic actually I'm quite happy with it um, and of course you get the sound effects and everything there's no you know there's no footsteps yet sound effects um, I'll add those in probably a bit later on um, the sky is actually a sphere with inverted normals and uh, with a little bit of uh, other few other magic tricks <laughs> so to speak um, to basically give it a um, a sky feel I guess a vol volumetric feel however it's a little bit less not as realistic when you start going to the other side let me go to the dark side because you'll see right away there's a bit of a, see that line going from there to there it's like a dark rainbow <laughs> um, basic uh oh I'm gonna land in some water here um, basically it's not as real because this is a sphere right so it's okay I'm gonna have to get back up Hold on. come on there we go. I don't even know which direction I'm going in. Let's go, <laughs> let's go that way. All right, let's come on. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Come on. There we go. All right, get me out of here. Okay. So I'm going to go up one of these mountains, and I want to show you the atmosphere. Um, I can probably get give you a better idea of what's going on. Um, okay, let me see here. So we have a atmospheric glow effects. Um, it's actually um, an asset that I got that I took and I modified. Actually, the, the water was also from uh, an asset that I uh, acquired, and I modified the shader and all, all, all the uh, source code and to make it work. So now it works on a sphere. All right. So coming up to the top, we'll fly off this edge. I got to deal with these peaks too because. Some of these peaks are pointed, and I gotta smooth these out. Um, I don't know if it's a problem with the algorithm or just after doing some random bumps that somehow some peaks get knocked up. But I wonder if there's a, a way that I can actually run through this and um, soften certain peaks as like a, a softening algorithm of some sort later on, maybe. Anyways, here we go. See if I can get out of the. Oh yeah, here we go. Here, we go. so you can see the kind of the scattering and the atmospheric glow that occurs when you leave the planet. But see the the um, 
how the shader works as you, um, I would guess, progress between the two. So it actually, the system actually knows how close you are to the ground. So as you go closer to the ground, right, you can see the sky get bluer and bluer and bluer and bluer. Right. And so you get more and more. But look at that. Isn't that beautiful? That's that's worthy of a screenshot key right there. If I had a screenshot key, but I don't have one. <laughs> but look at that. That's cool. I like that. Anyways, that's beautiful. Anyways, keep going. So um, as you go up, you it actually feels like you're leaving the planet. It's like the darkness is setting in. Um, it's like you're going into outer space, actually. So, I mean, eventually you will be. But for now, let's see if I can fly out of this. So I have the jump setting really strong. I have a really strong jump force put on. So when you hit jump, you're going to fly pretty high, which is fine because I want people to be able to fly out of the atmosphere and kind of get a feel for it. Look at that. You can see how the sun actually shines and glares off it just in that one spot. See just that one spot? Yeah. So I have all the... Um, uh, the way I have this... I have this big sphere all around the planet. Again, you can see from this that we'll... Oh, shit. I just... <laughs> that scared me. <laughs> they realized I landed in the water. <laughs> oh, man. So, um, yeah, here we go. Um, let's run along the beach here. Woohoo! Little bits of water here and there. Um, so let's go towards the, uh, the sun. You'll see things become a lot more vibrant and bright. Oh, no! No, let's not run into the water. Okay. Can I jump over this? How big is this? Let's see if I can jump over this. Oh, no. I didn't get enough running jump. No. <laughs> Where am I going? <laughs> get me out of this. Oh, this is huge. Oh, <laughs> this is like an ocean. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay. <laughs> if you go... Let me actually show you something. If you go to the deep... Part of the ocean um, you'll see that these pebbles actually turn to another type of stone um, I don't know if you can see that here or not it will go deep enough no it's not deep enough there, there's like a it goes to like a bedrock stone if you go deep enough I don't know if I can find it here but I don't know if you guys want to play it by the way it is downloadable so you can go ahead and download it and play it on martianworlds.com uh, where's the Sun there you are okay that's that's where I want to go Let's go, actually, let's go over there to the mountains. All right. If you guys can picture some grass here. Um, I've got some grass and plants and some other um, things to, to put on the textures. You can also see how, um, maybe here, yeah, you can see it better from this angle, how that mountain comes down and then snakes across over there, and it actually splits off in multiple directions. That one splits off and goes that way. Um, so. It, a lot of these mountains actually start from a peak and actually will walk this way and then it'll go back up to the peak and then walk down this way and then go back up to the peak and so it, it follows it sort of like a, a arteries like veins right and which seems a lot more natural actually to what mountains should be but yeah let's go towards the sun which is over there no <laughs> Oh, this gravity is killing me. It's way too uh, too light, so the gravity is not very strong on this planet. And, well, it's a very small planet, so it's not going to be like gravity anyway. So, um, But anyways, let's, let's go up here. See if we can go up to the top of this here. That's what I'm aiming for. There we go. <clears throat> oh, yeah, we got some nice snowy peaks going on up here. Oh, Sandy Beach. So... You hear that music playing in the background? Yeah, that's something I created about a year and a half ago when I was working on uh, uh, a similar project. Um, I guess it was more of a 2D game at the time, an idea that I had to start with, and then I decided to explore more 3D stuff instead um, to see if I can't go that direction instead of a 2D game. And I'm glad I did, because this is a really beautiful view right here. I really need to install that, um, or set up that, take a screenshot key. <laughs> yeah, that'll have to be uh, next on my list, but anyways. Um, yeah, so I mean, go ahead and download it. Again, it's at martianworlds.com. Uh, and uh, you can play with it. 
and you know there's certain things uh, I have to uh, deal with still with uh, of course uh, let me go to the dark side here again uh, as you can see here uh, you can see that line with that gradient yeah that has to be fixed so I guess the biggest things right now are like the uh, the sky effect um, the kind of a scattering effect and you got the um, uh, dark side of the planet and you got this water with the fog effects the bubbles the lens uh, wet lens effect so all these effects are in there now go ahead and check them out and uh, tell me what you think but go ahead and get oh look at that yes but notice there's a little bit of an ambient glow to the uh, to the water still so I'll have to look into that because I don't want the water to be glowing on the dark side no not unless it's irradiated then no glow <laughs> if you want to follow radiation then by all means go ahead okay so we'll just keep moving here so that's pretty much it I'm just kind of you know gliding around here just showing it off he's uh oh yeah look at that so you can see now the sun is completely gone some water water foam effects going on here and so there's a little bit of ambient glow around the atmosphere so let's see if I can't go around to the other side and then we'll end the video looks like the sun's over there I see the glow so we'll go that way run forest run <laughs> oh look at that yeah go towards the sun hey that rhymes all right let's keep going oh yeah look at that look at that glow in the mountain huh that's awesome let's actually go up there oh look at that oh yeah there's the sun oh snowy peaks oh let's actually get a nice running jump off the top of this thing oh yeah let's go way up here if you guys are playing this game too just go to the top of some of these peaks <clears throat> and uh, jump off just have some fun uh, check out see how high you can go actually I, I've, I don't know if I found the highest peak yet because they're all you know pretty random oh see you can't really see the atmosphere as much when you're up here um, to be expected I suppose see if I can not oh yeah I think I got that oh there we go there we go check that out see over there there's not much scattering but here there's more scattering so it actually worked out quite nicely lens flare effect and all take it oh look at that all right beautiful beautiful I can't wait to get some foliage on here um, some trees some grass some stuff like that anyways that's all there is Thanks, and uh, go ahead, comment, like, let me know what you think, and um, again, subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, stay tuned for the next one, so you'll know when I have more stuff to offer, and uh, we'll go from there. Go ahead, download MarshallWorlds.com, and have some fun with it. Thank you.